Adjusting the slide order of a presentation is as simple as drag and drop. Right or control click on a slide and I can add a new slide after it. Or I can skip the slide. When I do that, the slide thumbnail gets squeezed between the slides that are still visible in Navigator View. I can still select and edit it though. In Lighttable View, the slide is visible but has a gray cast over it. And in Outline View, its icon gets squeezed like in the Navigator View. When the slideshow is played, the hidden slide won't appear. So hiding slides in a presentation can be good if you have different or shorter versions of a presentation that require slides to be avoided or skipped. Notice that I have two slides here meant to start different sections of the presentation. While in Navigator view, I can group slides into sections. So I'm going to move slides 4, 5, and 6 under section 1 by dragging their thumbnails to the right just a little. Notice how the vertical blue line here jumps over. These slides are now under the section 1 slide, or slide 3. I can show and hide all of them now using this turn down triangle. I can continue nesting slides so there can be subsections within the presentation. When I select a slide, the Format Inspector switches to Slide Layout Controls. For this title slide, I could maybe remove the body text, or add the slide number. To show the slide number for all the slides in a presentation, go to the Slide menu here and Show Slide Numbers on All Slides. From the Format Inspector, the background of any slide can be changed. So maybe for this section 1 slide, I want a plain black background. So I can switch from image fill to color fill and select black. Switch back to image fill to return to the industrial theme background. Switch to advanced image fill to add a color overlay to the background. Switch the scale menu to tile and the background image expands. Now the section 1 slide still fits into the industrial theme, but it adds a little variety to the background and colors. So even though you add each slide from a theme, the look of any slide can be adjusted to fit your presentation. Next we'll go over how to edit and add master slides. So when you make background adjustments like this, they can be applied to other slides with the same master.